So part two of the seventh anniversary celebration on JP has officially begun, and that means we can now get some more of these 77 summon tickets. Now, you guys might remember that in part one of the celebration, we were able to get 22 out of the 50 required tickets for the free guaranteed LR multi, right? And now in part two with the new missions, we're able to get an additional 13 tickets, which brings our total to 35 out of 50 with the remaining 15 coming in uh, part three of the celebration. Now, in case you guys missed the uh, video talking about the part one tickets, I'll put a link to it above my head so you guys can go check that out. But in today's video, we're gonna be going over all of the part two missions that you guys need to complete to get all of the new part two tickets. So with that said, let's jump right into it. And we're gonna start here with three missions where you have to clear each of the new story events three times or one ticket each. And of course, I'm talking about the Fateful Meeting, Bulma and Vegeta story event, the Burn, Marriage, Decisive Battle, Big Circle story event, and also the Lineage of a Great Father story event. That's three clears each for one ticket per mission. And in case you guys don't know exactly which story events we're talking about here, it's the uh, Vegeta and Bulma story event, the Goku and Chi Chi story event, as well as the Gohan, Goten, and Trunks story event. So clear each of these a minimum of three times and you'll be able to get the first three tickets. Now from there, we have a mission where you have to use a support memory once for ticket number four, and then another mission where you have to equip a skill orb and clear a stage three times for ticket number five. And then there are a bunch of missions for clearing a stage X number of times, and this is for any stage, right? So for uh, 15 stage clears, you get one ticket. For 20 stage clears, you get another ticket. And then for 25 stage clears, you get two tickets. So that brings us up to uh, nine tickets now for part two, right? And uh, after that, we have a few missions for winning any Extreme Z battle. And if you win an Extreme Z battle stage one time, you get a ticket. And then for three times, you get two tickets. So that would be uh, 12 tickets now. And finally, for the 13th part two ticket, you have to token awaken a character two times. And that is all there is to it, guys. Like I said, 13 new tickets for part two. You should have a total of 35 tickets now if you followed all the missions for part one as well. And once part three of the celebration starts, I'll be sure to come back for a follow-up video to let you guys know how to get the remaining 15 tickets and complete the set. But for now, that's all I gotta say. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully this video helped some of you out there. And uh, as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content and uh, until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.